Hello guys, my name is Igor Fraga and I'm very excited to uh, show you guys what the ring looks like in the GT Sport a future that uh, like a lot of people was waiting for a long time here on GT Sport My first impression is basically um, you know, you have much less grip comparing to the uh, to the dry conditions and you have to be very careful with the throttle, with the braking you have to be very gentle try to kind of um, rotate the car as soon as possible in order to have a good exit because uh, if you don't, don't do that you are going to lose like a lot of time The rain looks like amazing, you know, uh, the reflection of the water in the, uh, in the asphalt, uh, the, the scapes and everything looks a little kind of cloudy and it's amazing. I, I want to see when, uh, you know, it's coming brighter and if really the sunshine will come in, if, if it does that, it will be like amazing to see it. Uh, driving on the wet, you basically uh, try to reduce uh, the braking as much as you can, rotate as quick as you can, like uh, don't try to carry as much speed in order to have uh, like a very good exit because uh, it makes a huge difference. Uh, coming out of uh, like low speed corner, you basically want to rotate as soon as you can, hit the throttle, control your uh, wheel spin and for the high speed corners you want to kind of carry a little bit more of speed but then still kind of do the late apex in order to have uh, a good exit and you really don't want to overshoot the corner on the entry because you will lose like a lot of time So just like on the real life you have uh, much less grip, you have to be very gentle with your braking and acceleration in order, in order uh, to put like much traction as you can on the exit of the corner, rotates your car uh, quickly and also like on the racing I think will be uh, the most impressive with, uh, with the spray, uh, with the you know, looking of uh, beautiful GT Sports rain, so um, it should be quite interesting.